Hey, what's up, YouTube? So, check this out. Um, I've been trying to see whether or not, as you can see right now, uh, I'm getting, like, a couple of notifications. One has to do with, um... <laughs> Alright, so I had to get rid of the dirty stuff. Not really. But, uh, check this out. So... Um, I was very skeptical whether or not I should go ahead and update it, knowing that the confirmations are true, the rumors are very, very true. This little notification where the Smith, um, the Smith application is disabled due to the, its expiration, well, the update that you see above it is basically what, um what fixes that so what goes on from here is a lot so what i'm trying to get at is that um i've been very very um you know skeptic whether or not i should update it i've been reading it does fix it but it also removes a couple of certain features that I do like, which one is the flashlight. Now, I am going to see whether or not I can um, get in contact with HTC to verify what would be the reason why um, the flashlight uh, got removed. Uh, another thing is that I've been trying to see a back way to it, and there is a solution to uh, save whether or not uh, you want the flashlight back into your life. Um, if HTC removed it, it's due to the fact that it did eat up the battery. I was looking into the permissions and to see what exactly the application does. And to be quite honest, running or not running, it does uh, drain the battery due to its uh, the way that it was uh, coded, I guess. I'm not really sure. Um, but each and every time you touch the screen, you notice that the... Uh, or when you touch the power button, it, it vibrates and all this other stuff. But um, there is a solution to it. And the thing is, you're going to have to download, or I did have this before. It's called the uh, SanDisk uh, Memory Zone. And what you might want to do is go ahead and back up everything. Well, not back up everything, just the applications. And what should happen here is that if you have um, if you have a Google Drive or something, it should back it up all the way into uh, Google Drive. So uh, what you want might want to do after that is um, is go ahead and update it, I guess. And once it's removed, uh, go back into your Google Drive, take the flashlight APK, install it. It's going to tell you uh, a security feature. Hey, do you want to uh, install an application that's not really authorized? You go ahead and click the check mark that goes above it. And uh, it should fix the solution where you don't really have to go into the Play Store and uh, download a third party application where, you know, you get filled with uh, ad advertisements. Sorry. Um, but yes, that is the uh, background solution to it. But again, if HTC removed this application, it's due to the fact that, you know, it did drain the battery. And I can confirm that, yes, this application does drain a huge tons amount of battery life. Because if you notice, if you're less than 10% on your battery, the flashlight will not turn on. So uh, that's a good food for thought, and uh, yes, it's sad to say that the flashlight is going to be missed, but HTC does this a lot. It's happened before. I've noticed this a huge amount of times when it came to the HTC uh, Evo 4G LTE, where if I was to connect my uh, Beats headphones onto the phone, it would determine which Beats headphones I had. Uh, it, it was a cool feature. It was sad to see it go and then get turned into some 
crappy feature where you just turn it on and off. But again, uh, it's it's kind of a weird mood by HTC. And it, to be quite honest, I read a lot on it. And the update itself is 1.5 gigabytes. If you go to the HTC website, you go down below uh, and you go ahead and download the ROM. But this is after doing a, uh, a a full restore, like a factory default. So I guess it's uh, it's a huge move, and you're gonna need the HTC Sync Manager, and then do the do the proper uh, flash, uh, you know, boot ROM settings and all this stuff. It's it gets quite technical. I mean, if anything, if, if push comes to shove and um, half of these bugs that are on this phone don't get fixed, I guess I will do a full uh, flash RUU um, ROM upload. But uh, yeah, guys, I, I don't want to take more of your time, but I will keep you posted. And once I get this done, uh, I will post up uh, confirmation that I do have the uh, flashlight under the new uh, uh, update settings but till then thank you guys for watching do rate subscribe let me know what you guys think of the new update if you guys did it so far I haven't done it I'm trying to uh, find out my solutions as you can see I'm backing up a lot of uh, information so uh, do subscribe and I'll keep you guys tuned in as to whether or not this was a good move.